So this is a new start menu, presumably coming with the release of Windows 11 version 25H2 that offers a bigger interface and brings together the pen, the recommender and all apps section into a single scrollable interface. However, before the company picked this design, it considered other designs. Now, on the first design that the company was testing, we can see that it was going for two columns and on the left, we can see some sort of tiles that will give you some information to make it easier to pick up applications where you left off and on the right we can see just regular icons to launch your applications. An interesting feature for this particular design was the create button to allow you to create different types of documents but in an easier way. Now on the second design we can see that the company was going for more rounded corners and in addition to a newer design to group apps we can also see more evidence of Microsoft testing which on the start menu and right here we can also see the for you section that it would allow you to pick up applications where you left off just like on the first design the third design reminds me more like the Microsoft Store app because of the left rail to switch between the different tabs but we can also see that the start page is a little bit cluttered with apps and tiles to resume other tasks however it's interesting to see this shortcuts section at the bottom to access your installed applications this is the design number four and this design actually reminds me to the start menu from Windows 10. We have a two column design and on the left you can access your recent apps and basically all your other apps just like on Windows 10 and on the right that's where you used to access the live tiles but in this case we have a section for pens and at the bottom we can see another section that will surface all your recently opened apps with bigger thumbnails to make it easier to identify those documents and pick up where you left off. And the last design concept is a full screen start menu which is divided in two different modules. At the top we have the search box and then we have different sections for the different things that you can do with the start menu. At the top we also have the pin apps section that not only allows you to pin your apps but you can also create different folders and we can see one more time that Microsoft was planning into some sort of widgets right inside of the start menu. Now from here we can see the create feature and if you remember the button for the first sign if you click that button you will have something similar to this and according to this design the create feature will just give you some ideas on content that you can create and Microsoft was also planning a for you section at the bottom that will surface your recent activities to help you pick up where you left off so which concept would you have picked for Windows 11 let me know in the comments also follow me for more Windows tips